Hey everybody, this is Kvam from Kvam Arts. Today I'm going to do some silver nitrate, but first I need to uh, heat this bronze up to get the moisture out. To get all the moisture out of the sculpture before I apply the silver nitrate. Now the silver nitrate, I do buy in crystals from a chemical store. I do about a quarter teaspoon for eight ounces of water. Silver nitrate needs to be applied much hotter than ferric nitrate to achieve an opaque effect. So I'm using my small torch here to really focus the heat where I'm working. And when it's really hot like this, I can get an opaque, sil an opaque silver, which actually looks like it's a concrete color. If it gets buffed afterwards, it does show silver. But I'm going for a concrete stone look, so I'm keeping it opaque. Now this brush I'm using, it's just a normal acrylic brush. Uh, make sure you never use a brush that you use for oil painting. No oils. Can you guess how I know this? Because I've accidentally done it myself. I did figure out in the next segment how to keep my uh, patina stand from turning while I'm working on it. <laughs> Hello. Now it's really hard to apply the silver nitrate this hot without a spattering onto the bronze next to it where you don't want it. There are ways to stop this in the future I will show later on, but with this piece in particular, I plan on doing things with that those backgrounds anyway, so I'm not so concerned about the splatters right now. They will be hidden. Yeah, because if it splatters, it can't be taken off. So there we have it, silver nitrate.